Greetings, this is J.P. Veneer. How, how does one know they are a vampire? I still and will always believe that vampires, unlike humans, they get energy from other sources because their bodies will not, not have enough for what they are. I also believe we are spiritually different than humans and that and what we are is a spiritual condition. The simple definition of a vampire is one who needs energy because their bodies don't have enough for their soul. We take it through the blood, some of us take it through the blood, some of the life force of human energy is in the blood. The taking of it directly, or taking of it directly if we are strong enough. Most vampires are tired and drained when alone, but are usually hyper, often with high anxiety and feel high in the when they are in large crowds. We may t also take it from animals and nature, but the best source is human since we are also human. Most normal people can get the energy they need from food in the sun, but vampires often feel hungry and thirsty all the time without satisfaction, and they still feel tired, especially when they are alone depending on how well they know how to feed. All vampires have a vampire soul, and they're, or they are just humans who practice vampirism. There are two main types of vampires, human vampires and vampire spirits. The, the human living vampires are part of the part human and part vampire. There's also pure blood vampire spirits and they are not human, and don't have a human body. Of course, you won't find any of these vampires on types. Of, of course, you won't find any of these vampires on the internet, and and they are rarely in our realm. There are also other types of vampires, depending on how they choose to feed, or feed best. There are psychic vampires who feed off the psychic energies around them, and sanguine vampires who feed only on blood, which is plasma or energy contained within it. Next, I'm going to read you about vampire spirituality. I consider myself vampirian, and this has been a focus of Temple UVUP, I will explain this below, for a few years now. I believe in the constant vampire spiritual awakening as a vampire, which has led to my, a vampire awakening. I want to, the community to be united in knowledge of what vampirism is, what, is and what they are capable of. I also believe vampires are spiritual beings. This has been my spirituality as well as what I am. I believe in many deities as well as Satan, Luc Satanism, Luciferianism, Paganism, Christianity, Eastern Spirituality, Judaism, Egyptian e Eastern Spirituality, and Spiritual Humanism. But, but most importantly, I am my own God, and as we are as vampires. I believe vampirism is a part of my life, as well as my spirituality, and what makes vampirism a spiritual condition is that we are, are humans, we have a vampire spirit or soul, so we are both human as well as vampire. I believe Layla is our dark mother, or you may return to refer to her as Lilith. My personal belief is that angels, demons, or gods who decided to come to this realm mainly with human females and more vampire children. Vampirism comes from vampire gods. We also come from evolution of the soul, or, or some humans can evolve into vampire gods, or, or while some can just practice vampirism by learning it. Many of the religions of the world 
although not although not completely false, are actually created by humankind and blind them from the vampire gods that have been around as, as well before them and survive on their energies. Many of them, though modern religions are actually an offset of the vampire spirituality. A few of these religions are Satanism, Luciferianism, and other vampire religions that have truth in them, but also false. Um, okay, that's all I'm going to talk about about that. But you can find it in my book or on my website, vampirian.org, to find all that information at. Thanks.